folks, as you can tell right now, the Nature Boy Ric Flair is in the ring with the World Heavyweight Champion, Captain America. Take it away, Rick. Woo! Thank you, Freddy. Now, Captain America, a lot of people are calling you Winter Soldier and Bucky because that's what you normally wrestle by, one of them two names. You were the sidekick of the original Captain America. What, how do you feel when people say that they question your validity of being the world champion? Well, Nate, it's like this, Nature Boy. You've held this title numerous of times. Freddy's held this title. Even Vince has held this title. I earned my spot. I came in with Steve Rogers as Bucky. I went out on my own, became Winter Soldier. When Steve Rogers wanted to start wrestling as Steve Rogers instead of Captain America, I took on the Captain America persona. I represent what the U.S. is all about. I represent what the world's all about. I represent action figure wrestling as the world champion. And I am the world champion. I am the greatest action figure wrestling world champion there is. No, no offense meant towards you, Nate. But I know there's a certain one half of the world tag team champions who's going around questioning my validity. He's questioning action figure wrestling's validity for allowing me to win this championship. I earned this championship. Nobody let me win it. That's why I'm the world champion of action figure wrestling. And he can question me all he wants. He can go around and talk about how he's the best in the world at what he does. But look at every company he's been in. He's been in ECW for a little while. He was in WCW, WWE. He's wrestled in Canada. He's wrestled all over the world. He's a huge superstar. But he's letting that ego go from reality and into his head here in action figure form. Now granted, he is one of the best in the world and I will never take him lightly. But when him and Savio Vega lose their world tag team titles I will beat both of them and prove that it, why I'm the world champion hold it hold it hold it right there hold it hold it hold it right there ladies and gentlemen it's Chris Jericho Now, you talk about me, you talk about Y2J. I was the first United Champion, undisputed champion in WWE history. I've held major world titles in every major company just about that I've been in. And you want to talk about your validity? You didn't earn that, you didn't deserve that. I'll make a deal with you. Freddie Glass is standing over there. He's the current main manager of Action Figure Wrestling. Why don't we have him agree or disagree to give you, to allow me to go ahead and take my shot now at you to become the world champion. You want my gold? You want my world title? Okay, I'll give you a shot at it if Freddie Glass is okay with it. But this is the deal. When you and Savio Vega lose y'all's world tag team titles, you're no longer able to wrestle for action figure wrestling. World title. You give up your number one contendership. How does that sound? Okay. If you want to put it that way, if you want to take the best in the, uh, best in the world at what he does on, you got a deal. And the thing is, if I beat you as long as I'm action figure wrestling world champion you will never ever ever get a shot at the world title again Woo! what do you say to that classic Betty Lassie what I say about that I say if them two pencil neck geeks want to get it on that's our main event 
and that'll be after the battle royal. We'll be back after these messages.